right, here we are at the Mitchells' house. We've got the brand new pond that they just dug for the ducks. This is Puddle Duck. There's Ducky getting out of the water. Everybody's doing a little bit of bathing. It's a lovely spring day here in Whoville. Where are you going, Ducky? And there's Puddle Duck. Handsome white Pekin. There's Ducky in the background flapping his wings. They both came to live with the Mitchells because they both have leg injuries and they would not have survived winter on McKinnon's Pond. So they came here. The Mitchells live out in the township, so they're allowed to have waterfowl as pets. And these two have a really good life here. They're spoiled rotten. They have Nice warm winter quarters in the garage next to what I believe is a Skylark, a 1960 Skylark, a Skylark car, pretty cool. Um, lots of straw to keep them warm, a heater, lots of food. And then here we are come spring and the Mitchells built this lovely new pond just for the ducks who are very busy making themselves presentable. So these two abandoned domestic ducks get a happy ending and a forever home. This is not a typical ending. Um, one of the ducks down at McKinnon's Pond was killed just the other week by a predator. There was nothing left. There goes Ducky back in the pond. There was nothing left of the duck except feathers and one foot. So when they're abandoned uh, at City Ponds, that's usually their fate and it's a pretty grisly one. These two got lucky. They um, they were looked after by me and then I handed them off to the Mitchells and they're going to live out their days in very good style here. Well loved and well looked after. So that's Ducky, the black one, and Puddle Duck is the white one. Now you've met them, you know who I talk about on my blog, you can put a face to a name.